Good evening, everyone. Today's question is a question which is based on uh, the, it's kind of logic and data interpretation. It is based on the number of days that people take to complete a job. Let us try to see this question. It says A takes eight days and B takes N days to complete a job when working alone. A and B work on the job on alternate days. If they take exactly the same time, irrespective of who starts the job, what is the maximum integral value of n? Try to do it yourself first. Ek pehle apne se karo, then we will do it together. Okay, just think about this. Suppose, suppose let's say that A starts the job. But how much work can A do in one day? A takes eight days to complete the job. So in one day, A can do one eighth of the job. B takes n days to complete the job. So in one day, B can complete one nth of the job. So if A starts doing the job, then A will take 1 by n, 1 by 8. Ugly then B will do 1 by nth work. Then A will do 1 by 8th work. B will do 1 by nth work and so on. If B starts the job, first day A, B will do 1 by nth work. Then A will do 1 by 8th work. Then B will do 1 by nth work and so on. Now. Suppose they take even numbers to complete the job. Then the two sums will be equal. So whether I add, suppose they take four days to complete the job. Then it will be 1 by 8 plus 1 by n plus 1 by 8 plus 1 by n. When A starts the job. If B starts the job, it will be 1 by n plus 1 by 8 plus 1 by n plus 1 by 8. So same it will add karke. But if they take odd number of days to complete the job, then here pe plus A ek bari extra kaam karega 1 by 8. And here pe B ek bari extra kaam karega 1 by N. But they have said that they take same time to complete the job. Which means that I cannot have this. I cannot have this. So which means that they are taking even number of days to complete the job. Is this clear? Okay. Now, Suppose the number of days, because it's even, I'm doing 2 into x. Kar rahi so suppose the number of days they take to complete the job is 2x. But how much work will be completed in 2 days? 1 by 8 plus 1 by n. And then this cycle keeps repeating itself for x days, right? So into x, this is how many times the cycle will get repeated. Every 2 days they complete this much into x. This is the number of work they do. So the the total work that they, uh, the total days that they take is one, uh, I mean, the work completed will be 1 by 8 plus 1 by n in two days. And then they will repeat it for x. So it is going to be into x. Is this clear? This is going to be equal to 1. So from here, we will go ahead and we can solve for x. So x key for n. So if you solve for n, you will get the value of n as 8x by 8 minus x. But I want to maximize this value. Agar is value ko maximize karna hai. If I want to maximize n, I must maximize numerator and minimize denominator. I can only take integer values. So the denominator is minimum when x is 1. Sorry, x is 7. And numerator is maximum when x is 7. x cannot take 8. If x takes 8, it will be 0. Denominator will be 0. It cannot be 0. x has to only take integer values. So x can take the value 7. 8 minus 7 will be 1 in the denominator. 8 into 7 will be 56 in the numerator. So n will be the value. The value of n will be 56. So in this case, the answer to this question will be 56. It's a good, difficult question, but you should try to attempt this.